Hi, this is Malti at the Middle News Service. Um, oh, thank you so much for returning my call. The newsroom is is the real thing. I had journalists who come and visit here, they look around and they say, boy, this is just like the real world, and it really is. Medill has a unique program, graduate program, with a professional news service. We're sending out dozens of stories every day and then posting them on our website. The students are down here uh, for three full days, and it, it, it's like a job. It's not a simulation. It is real. So, you know, the expectations are high, and and uh, the pace is pretty frenetic. I don't know that anybody else offers uh, quite the same experience in, in, in American journalism education. This is pretty special. The day can be pretty hectic if you're working on deadline. Um, you're constantly waiting for people to call you back. Some of them are really good about getting back to us and you're, you're always just waiting for that call so you can get a good quote. Um, and if you have any multimedia you're doing, you're going to be outside shooting videos, taking pictures, and trying to add more to your story. A typical day is definitely 9 to 5. I rarely get out of here early. And um, I come in, do some research, make some phone calls, often we'll go out. Um, or if I'm covering an event, I'll cover an event and come back. I usually get in around 7.30, read the paper, uh, try to figure out my story ideas either the night before, shoot some emails out to PR reps, and then it's just hitting the phones, writing, rewriting, looking over press releases, getting on a Bloomberg machine, uh, looking up numbers, trying to fit numbers together in a way that tells a story. Today I'm web producing. Um, basically what that entails is uh, coordinating all the stories that we have on the uh, budget uh, for the day and making sure they're coming in in a timely manner. All Medill courses, and, and certainly Ekine, um, start right from the ground up. In fact, we or, or encourage people to select beats, or whatever it may be. Pick something that you want to learn about. I really wanted to focus on ethnic groups and health. That's sort of a new interest for me. I'm writing a Corley earnings story for Arthur, Arthur J. Gallagher and Company. Corley earnings, it's a very basic reporting skill that uh, we learn here. You get good things in all of the reporting classes in the Chicago newsroom. I would say if you are interested in telling stories about people and government impacts on those people, people, urban is probably the place you want to come to. And today we're looking at some election follow-ups, uh, the, the recent primary um, uh, election obviously is, a, is possibly not a big deal for some of the Illinois voters based on what we've been hearing, but it, it should be. Um, so we're, we're uh, looking at that and then we're also looking at a couple of stories on um, widespread hunger in the Chicago area. Every single media outlet, whether it's you know BBC, um, CNN, they're all running health, environment, and science stories. Students learn to uh, to bridge the gap between science and the community, between science and their lives. These are some of the defining issues of our ages. I chose health and science uh, because I noticed over my life I always ended up reading the science and health articles. Um, I realized I really cared about health a lot. If you'd like to work internationally or if you'd like to cover the most compelling domestic story of our time, and most of all, if you'd like to have a job, you should think about econ. These are useful skills whether you want to be a business writer or whether you want to cover the arts or sports or social problems, behind everything there's a dollar sign. It's not like any track is, is going to make you necessarily a better reporter, but the opportunities that business gives you from going to Bloomberg or going to CME Group, all those are really useful and they put you in touch with some good people and uh, I think they prepare you um, really well. They make it sound like it's really scary and hard, but you're completely prepared after methods to come in here. Um, I like it better because it's more of a newsroom environment. And the professors are really great and really helpful, and they know their stuff. And I really like the environment here. You get to just you know, focus on you, do your work, and um, they're really supportive. By the end of the day, we have a website, and uh, that's not really when it ends, but that's when it slows down.